Dark matter might actually be possible now. There was a shining glimmer of hope that was brought to us in our comments section. And I said last week, we already had our biggest comment ever. This week has absolutely crushed that one. Because in our last video, our top comment was from Cam saying, enough is enough. Get the 1911 gold. So that's what we're doing today. <sighs> Thank you, Cam. And thanks to all of you for making this happen. It would not have happened without all you voting for it. And with Cam having a change of heart. So make sure you go down there and you leave your suggestions again. And make sure that you vote for other ones that you want to see me get done. Anyways, now that we're actually getting some progress today, I'm pretty happy. Uh, we got to get the 1911 done. So I have it here in the class. We already have it leveled up since we did it in zombies. But uh, I think the class I'm going with, at least for right now, is going to be the Microflex LED, the Sound Suppressor, the Task Force Barrel. Right now I have the 12 round mag in here. I think I'm going to switch it to the 14 round. And then I'm going to go with our Airborne Elastic Wrap on our handle. And as for our camos, I don't have too much done. I have 12 kills with this thing in multiplayer. So odds are we don't have a whole lot here. But we actually have two long shots, surprisingly. So <laughs> that's two less long shots than we need to get throughout this whole thing. But we need to get all of our headshots, which is 50. We need to get five kills without dying 20 times. Not too bad. 25 long shots. We're already two on the way there. 25 enemies detected, stunned, or blinded by score streaks, equipment, or field upgrades. So we can get that one done pretty easily. It's only 25. When you get 25 enemies taking cover from us, should not be that awful. And then two or more enemies rapidly 25 times. I think we can knock this out pretty fast, actually. And as for our class, I would normally use Lawbreaker, or not Lawbreaker, Gunfighter. So I can have the more attachments on my pistol, but that's only for our primary weapons. So I think we're, we're probably good with Perk Greed. I think that's fine. And then we got Stim, Tomahawk, and Field Mike. I think our class is probably fine. I'll probably tweak it here and there throughout the grind. But let's go ahead, hop in, and try to get this thing done. All right, we're spawning here on Amsterdam. Seems like they forgot to turn on the sun. So I don't know what the hell's happening here. This is, really isn't my favorite face-off map. It's even less so without light. There it is. But I've chosen hardcore because I really like using single pistol. I feel like it's a lot easier to aim and try to like get specific challenges with, with just one of them. Oh, geez, my aim is awful. But also, I'm rocking the silencer here. It's probably not the best attachment, but there's something about a silenced pistol that just makes it more fun. You really feel like 007 when you actually like go on a nice streak. And I haven't even watched any of the James Bond movies. It's really weird using a gun that actually shoots. Like, the closest thing we've done to uh, actual, like, something that fires anything has been the nail gun, and that is that was awful. So, going back to something that can actually do some damage, it's kind of weird. Especially since I'm so used to like just running up and hitting people with all the melee weapons that we've done. Like me trying to aim at somebody just feels awful right now. It's going to take some getting used to. Oh, especially with people running around instantly shotgunning me. There we go. We finally got a kill. Anyone else want some? Hmm? This guy? Yeah. Get that trophy system out of here. Get you out of here. That's another one. Oh, there's somebody else in there. I'm still like struggling to find the right controller settings like i've been trying to get videos done ahead of time before i go on vacation here so i've been grinding the snipers a little bit like off camera trying to just get the cameras close enough so i can make a quick video on them and i've changed up like my settings a lot i've changed like my dead zones i up my sensitivity to like 11 and i feel like i need a different sensitivity for whatever weapon i'm doing like for the snipers i like the high sensitivity it's nice to be able to like flick to things try to get like nice shots move around a little easier but then here with the pistol, I feel like I can't aim. Like, I go to aim and track somebody, I'm, like, over, like, flicking away from them. Like, my sensitivity feels too fast now. And I know that there's, like, a, a low zoom sensitivity and a high zoom sensitivity. But I feel like I am always, like, on the opposite spectrum of what I need to be at, if that makes any sense. There's our 25 eliminations with the pistol. Quick camo. But I, I can never find, like, a sensitivity that suits me. And then every time I'm starting to get like, like used to something, I end up just getting slammed game after game. And I'm like, oh, it's my sensitivity. And then I change it. It's like, I, I never give myself time to get used to one. I feel like I can be doing much better. Like it, for as long as I've been actually using a controller now, you feel like I'd be like better at it, but I'm really not. I'm quite awful as you can tell. Oh my Lanta, I got the last bullet on him. I'm doing kind of decent now. There we go. That's a quick headshot. Oh, that's a five times. Quick bloodthirsty. Just need a few more of those. All right, 23 and 22. We ended up going positive a little bit. Not that bad. You know, despite the whole me not being able to aim, me being ass on controller, me having like the thumbs of a newborn baby, I'm just so glad to be getting weapon progress again or camo progress again. Because for, I think about two months... Of, of Cam's reign of terror. We were just getting pounded with melee weapons, special weapons. We were stuck, getting absolutely no progress. And now 
Cam has turned a new leaf and we're just getting closer to dark matter again. I, I, I love to see it. And I, I kind of forgot how fun it is to just grind multiplayer camos. Like it does take a lot longer than a zombies camo would, but it's very it, like satisfying to do. Like we still have launchers to do, so I'll probably change my opinion once we get to those. But like, it's such a long grind. You use like damn near every weapon in the game. And then you have to go against like real people. Like in zombies, you can kind of cheese it. Once like you get into a routine, you know your spots, you know exactly what to do, how to get the camos. It's pretty like rinse and repeat. Multiplayer, game modes change. The amount of people playing those game modes change. You got to switch up your strategies. And especially now that I'm playing on like a new peripheral, like going from keyboard and mouse to controller, like it completely changes how I play and like look at these camos and I, I need to do it like differently. And it's helping me kind of prepare for Modern Warfare next year, or I guess in the next few months, because you know I'm going to be going for whatever their mastery camo is, like Damascus 2, whatever they're going to call it. You know, I'm going to be grinding the shit out of that. Ooh, that was a nice shot. Quick little long shot on him. Ooh, I got that. I don't understand how some of these guys are hitting these shots. As much as I'm trying to go for these long shots, I'm just getting like slammed every time I peek any kind of angle. Ooh, there's another long shot. Oh, that's a teammate. Shit. Not me to do that. Okay, actually, maybe this is good. We start out having like bad games where we're going 6 and 16 very early into it. 6 and 17 now. But th this just means that maybe they'll be more lenient on me. Maybe uh, the SBMM gods will be like, you know what? This guy sucks. Let's give him some easy lobbies. Hopefully this does not set the tone for the entire grind but they, they see that i need some help over here Ooh, there we go quick double as long as i'm still getting camo progress i don't care what my kd is i can go 8 and 21 for all i care but if i come out of here with like one or two more camos that's fine with me but this has been like the most uh standoff game i've had of face off Nobody's really getting past their own train cars. It's all people holding angles. This is crazy. Everybody's been very disciplined. Ooh, finally lined up that long shot. Yeah, this could be a good time to just try to knock all these long shots out and I won't even have to worry about them because this guy seems to be really enjoying his spot over here. Oh, and there's the game. 12 and 25. Please give me easier lobbies. Ooh. Oh, that's a double, a triple. Come on, one more for five times without dying. Oh, there we go. Thank God. Oh, let's go. Quick game on ICBM. Hopefully I can do some of the killing and not be getting killed. Okay. First death. But I just want to thank you guys for all the growth on the channel. We've been seeing a lot of new people come in and like subscribe, which is really, really cool. Uh, we just hit like 130,000 subs, like not that long ago. And now we're already at like 137,000. So really appreciate all the all you new people for coming in stopping by checking out the channel you know watching the videos and everything it, just, it means a lot like it, it's cool to see that we're still growing even playing a, a cod that's like a year out of its life cycle like even though i'm not too big of a fan of vanguard and i haven't been playing it like it's it's cool to see new people still come around even though we're not playing like all the newest content we're still just getting slammed i'm going negative again oh that's a quick four one more and that's our teleport camo and another five times quick six and a groovy camo oh shit we're going off this is what we've been waiting for please let me get some kills while we have a spy plane up it's like every time i call on a spy plane i just constantly die and i can't get any kills before it goes away please bro let me get a kill or something before this goes away and it's already gone what a waste i drop like nine kills in a row second i put on my spy plane i'm dead at 100 eliminations with it now. Ooh, that was a nice flick. Oh, one more kill. No! Oh! Oh, that could have been a crazy play. I was hitting the zombies aim there. I saw a lot of you guys pointing that out our last video. Uh, my controller muscle memory is all strictly based off of using dead shot and zombies. And it's been bad. Oh, two more kills. So we have a harp too. Let's throw it up. No, the game ended. Right as we got our harp. And we died 41 times. We're getting camos, but we're still getting slammed on at the same time. Oh, big mistake walking over here, buddy. I don't even need to shoot you. Ooh, another long shot too. I have like no bullets left in this. No, he got his revenge. Ooh, these long shots are gonna be done so easy. Forget how easy it is on Nuketown with a pistol. 
Oops, that's a teammate. Maybe it's not that easy. I'm kind of stupid. Ooh, we had a kill behind cover right there. Ooh, quick four. One more, one more. No! It's right back to the camo curse. Dying on four. No, died on four again. Oh, come on. One more. If I die on four again, I'm gonna freak out. Oh, thank God. Oh, we're all done with long shots. I didn't even realize. Oh, and we're all done with Flora too. Just really need kills behind cover. Five kills without dying. Some headshots and then almost done with our eliminations as well. We've made some really good progress. I actually don't even need to play Nuketown anymore if I'm already done with long shots and our like detected and stun kills. I just keep dying on four kill streaks. <laughs> this guy's body got stuck and he's sitting over here shooting at it. I can't lie. I've done that shit before too. Oh, and then I killed a teammate. Yeah, so I guess I'm still stupid. I can still laugh at other stupid people. We're one and the same. All right, I haven't been getting too many headshots. Haven't been getting too many five kills without dying. So I went ahead and switched to double pistols and we'll see if we do better with this. Okay, there's a quick triple, but still not four. And I'm not getting headshots. I just keep running into people using the street sweeper. I've had to block so many people. Like if I run into anybody using it now, I'm just, I'm just blocking them. Because hardcore is just riddled with people who think they're sweet. Pulling out the street sweeper and just closing their eyes and spraying. Like that guy right there. And they're still doing the gung-ho glitch. That shit was patched in like June of last year. All right, I got absolutely demolished in hardcore with the double pistols. So I changed around my attachments a little bit and now we're in core. Oh, that's three. There we go. That's five already. Maybe this is the way. Oh, there we go. Science camo two. This is the way. Ooh, damn, there's like 18 people there. This just breathed a breath of fresh air into this grind. I've been getting slammed for the last like 18 games. Oh! Oh, that's another five. Dude, these dual pistols and core are the move. We're halfway there on our five kills without dying. We'd probably already have it by now if I didn't die on four every time. Just four more kills behind cover and just about 11 more headshots and we're done. There we go. That's another five streak finally. Come on, one more kill. No, please don't take me out. No! Oh, we got five just barely there. Taken out right at the end. No, I died on four again. Oh, one more. Please don't let me die on five again. Oh, let's go. Oh, it's still going. That might have been behind cover as well. Oh, oh, he's body spraying now. This guy got mad. We got Marty McBalls pissed off. <laughs> oh, that's great. 44 and 18. We're hitting our stride. What? How do you survive getting shot in the eye? Okay. Ooh, that's 50 headshots. This has been so difficult. I'm not going to lie to you. The, the double pistols and core have definitely been helping. But the amount of times I'm just dying on four or just absolutely getting slammed in these games is atrocious. Oh, let's go. What a play. That's another five times. We take that and it's a camo. Five more five times now. There's a quick 10 times too. I wonder if they stack. I don't remember. I feel like they don't. Just to spite me. Oh, there we go. Another five times. I love the ICBM. If I could play ICBM 24-7, I would. Oof. Went on a nine times that time. Oof. 60 kills, 18 deaths. That's not bad. We got a lot of progress that game. Is this guy using pack-a-bunch camos? And I still shit it on him? These dudes got unlock tools and they're getting clowned on. Oh, we need one more five times. And three more kills behind cover and we're done. Oh, that's another five times and we're all done with five times. We just need kills behind cover now. Okay, so since we need kills behind cover, we need to be a little more accurate. I'm getting rid of the dual wield. I'm putting the suppressor back on. We're gonna go with a two-time scope on it. Oh, is that one? 
I hope so. I wish there was a medal for kills behind cover in this game still. For a camo that relies on other people doing something or standing in a certain spot, you think there'd be a way to check if you're doing it right. Yeah, I didn't get a single kill behind cover that game. I'm going back to hardcore to finish this. Now I just need somebody to like peek over these railings or over top of these computers or something so I can get these kills behind cover, please. That should be one. Oh, that should be one as well. Peek over, please peek over the railing. Come on, help me out over here. There it is. Got him. Ooh, that took a little trying, but we got it. I think I've maybe gotten two. Oh, if this guy wants to stay in this corner. Oh, he just got killed. Please go back to the railing. Oh, he's there. Let's go. Oh, and another one. There's gold, baby. We got it. We're all done. We don't have to do it anymore. And we finally, finally have some progress towards dark matter. Woo. We got one pistol complete. Uh, I think two more to go. I think it's only three that you need to do. Maybe. I don't know. But unless anything crazy happens, I'll see you guys when we're checking out the camos. All right, let's take a look at this glorious camo in our 1911. Oh my God. I said glorious too soon. I'm just happy that we actually have progress towards something, but holy shit is this coverage bad. All they did was replace the slide. I mean, that's cool, but this is it with gold. This is it without like very minor differences. I guess they kind of buff out the scratches or like the texture towards where like the trigger and everything is like all that metal on the bottom but like it don't change that much that's disappointing let's see what it looks like in game actually do any of these attachments change it nope suppressor don't change the barrel change a bit but that was the one thing that stays laser don't change anything the mags look the same the handles look the same dual wield ain't gonna change it does it look better with blueprints what about this one this one already has some sort of gold on it maybe it could look nice okay all right that's a lot better you just have to have a blueprint for it i don't even know how i got this it has to be free i don't think i bought any blueprints for this but the crazy part about this look at this all right if i take the camo off the mag is gold if i put the camo on it is not. You know how nice it would be to have a gold mag? But I can't. I can't have it. All right, now let's go look at it in game. All right, we're on D-Program, my new favorite map to show off camos. And this is what the 1911 looks like in gold. Very nice with this blueprint. The other one, not so nice, but we're going with the best that we can get right now. And this is it. I I'm just so happy that we have something else that's not a melee or a special done that I don't even care what it looks like. This thing could have no gold on it, but as long as it still counts... I'll take it. All right, there you have it. We finally made some progress towards dark matter. It's only taken us two months, but we're making it there. Uh, make sure that you guys, you know, keep supporting other comments that aren't melees or specials. You guys keep voting on them. You keep putting out your own suggestions. I need it, please. But uh, with that, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. So if you guys like this, and you wanna see more, go and leave a like on it. If you didn't and you don't dislike, if you're new here, Please consider subscribing, put out all kinds of Kai content throughout the week. If you want to, you can head on over to my Twitter, drop me a follow, it mean a lot. But that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.